Yeah, uh, how's it? I'm Jason. Uh, come down from Hamilton for the weekend with Clay. Um, it's my fifth trip down with Clayton. We're here near Rada hunting, and um, as you see, I'm by myself this time. None of the boys came down with me, but um, I'm sure I'm going to have a good time anyway. Uh, sweet ass, Jason. It's bloody good to have a good bugger like you come back again. Yeah, no, it's great. Yeah. Um, so Jason's after as many deer as he can get. So uh, we'll start with one, like like he said. We'll start with one and go from there. Um, the weather's going to be absolutely fantastic. It's going to be uh, westerly winds tonight, and then we're supposed to get a few showers in the morning, which um, will be bloody good. We need some rain. So um, we've got the bike loaded up, ready to go. So we'll um, get on up to the hut. I've got to validate my seven more green bags. We'll have a few shots out of that, and then um, wait for it to cool down a little bit, and then we'll start moving and we'll go and find something. Me? No roots back. No, you're going high. Yep, yeah, ain't low, bro. Quickly. Meh! Yeah, there, there on the fence line, up with the one around the fence. So it's um it's not too good. We've got the northwesterly wind which is pretty much up our arse all the way around the bush edge from the hut as soon as you leave. But um like I say I've been hunting this block for a few years so I sort of know a few little spots where we might be able to pick up an animal, but um she's pretty dry and the grass is short so it is gonna be reasonably hard this morning. Um we got back last night and fired a shot at, at the target 
and Jason's rifle was shooting about four inches high at 100 meters so um, that's why we went high last night a bit of a bugger but um, that's just the way it goes sometimes so um, hopefully we, uh, we've doled it back down 10 clicks and she's on their money at 100 meters now so we're going to uh, Jason's just coming back from dropping the kids off at the pool <laughs> and uh, Clayton's maybe. cooking I tell you <laughs> yeah, so we'll see how we go this morning hopefully, uh, hopefully we have a bit of luck on our side Beautiful, 300 meters, just pole exit, one on fence on road. Beautiful pit hit. Just keep it on where she goes. Fuck it. She's dead though. Good shit, bro. That's an awesome shooting. Awesome, bro. Wicked. 300 meters. You know where to aim on 300 now, eh? Oh yeah. <laughs> pole exit. <laughs> but better than from last night. Coaching from uh, Clayton here on the <laughs> distance. Now, uh, one fucking drum stoke, actually slow me too. Sweet. Well, um, the other one's run over into a kind of a spot to retrieve, but you definitely hit it hard. I've seen the impact. Yeah, I saw a jump. Yeah. So, you got two there. So, what we'll do is we'll zip over to this other spot that I know of yeah. and uh, see if we can pick up another two up there. Awesome. Sweet. Got two at once. Yep. Get him behind. You got two with one shot, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, you just made up then. Nice work. Good stuff. So here we were last night thinking um, all cards were down, there's wind and fucking no grass around. As you can see she's fucking She's pretty barren up here at the moment. Um, One shot there, you should be able to pick that up on the camera. It looked pretty good as you head shoot one yeah. shoulder shot the other one. <laughs> Might have been head and neck shot in the other one actually. Yeah. So that, that's bloody awesome. I wasn't planning on that, but that's the way it happened. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so you got your four deer that you wanted? Me? Perfect. Yeah, cheers. Thanks, mate. No, no worries, mate. Well, um, we've got the other one. What we got to these ones? Hey, Blake. Where's the deer? Where is it? them. Go figure it out soon. It's gone way past the stupid car. Oh, it was down there, eh? Let's just chase one through the fence. Yeah, he's just chased it back through the fence. Now he's coming back and you, those ones are there, he's coming straight back to them. Right, there's some wheel. Dead deer. Two deer with one shot. It's a pretty good going. Rightio, Jace. Um, these your double with one shot. Yeah, mate. Absolutely stoked, eh? Thought that that would never happen in a million years. Especially after you made me climb the bloody mountain this morning. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's been it's been a hard morning, but yeah, it's been worth it, eh? Yeah. Um, always a good time to aid any rider with you Clayton and um, you know, a bit of a rough night last night with the storm and stuff like that and we were a bit weary about what we'd see this morning but um, made the most of the opportunities that you know came up and you knew where the deer would be hiding so yeah, well, no, and, and you pulled off a couple of fantastic shots um, the first deer was 309 metres 
and just absolutely fucking poleaxed that and then the second deer was 310 or something like that and um, yeah, hit her as well hit her hard, she should be dead just over there and then I knew these yearlings they've been hanging around up on the um, fence line here they sort of mill around a little bit but they can get through but they just haven't figured out how to do it properly and uh, I had a sneaky suspicion they might be milling around up here and they were and uh, as you've seen on the video camera Jason shot two in the neck with one shot which is fantastic <laughs> A little, little bit tinny, but um, yeah. Alright, so we'll, um, we'll just leave these deer here while we um, sneak around and we'll grab the um, other deer that we shot the first thing this morning. They were um, lung shots, so they shouldn't be down in Germany. Um, the meat should be still good as gold, but we'll get down there and, and recover those now. Sweet ass. So um, here we are with Jace's, this is actually his third, third deer that we've recovered, but it's his first deer that he shot this morning. So this was the 300 metre shot that he did this morning and he smacked it right in the shoulder, aimed about uh, four inches over its back and it dropped. Two inches to the left of the wind if you can hear that. And um, just absolutely snotted her. So we're just gonna sort this girl out and then um, it's actually come out the neck, that's why. Looks like it's come out the neck. Might have been the angle. Maybe not. But yeah, we're just gonna sort this one out and we'll um head on down and grab the other one. Yeah. Sweet. Good. Might have to carry the other one. I'll just have a look down here. Blake seems to think it's down here, Jace. Where is it, Blake? Oh good boy. Oh here it is, mate. It's right here. It's gone a fair way. Good boy, Blake. Good boy. Well done. Well done, boy. Good boy, Blake. Good boy, mate. Nice big old hind. Good boy, mate. Good boy. Speak. Speak. Good boy. Speak. 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 Good boy. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again, Blake. Speak, Blakey. Blakey. Good boy. Blakey, Blakey. Good boy, that's what we want, eh? You're barking like that, that's perfect. That's how you do it, mate, eh? Hey. And then I know you found it. Hey, you knew this was here all the whole time. You went straight down here. Good boy. Well done. Getting way better. Hey, and you're barking. Where's it, Blake? Where's the deer? Good boy. Speak. Speak. Good boy. Where is it, Blake? Speak. Speak. Blake. Blake. Good boy. Good boy. But yeah. Ah, sweet, we found this one, which is good. So this is number four. Happy is. Successful. That's what you came for, to get four deer. Pick up two, so, yeah. yeah. Awesome, and Blake did really well. Um, we thought this deer would have been another 150 metres back up the hill, to be honest with you. I didn't think it would have actually made it this far, yeah. but it's, um, it's come a good 300 metres from where you shot it, eh? Yeah. Roughly, I'd round about. So. Maybe a little bit more, to be honest. Yeah. And, um, yeah, if it wasn't for the dog, Blake, um, I don't think we would have ventured this far down to find yeah. the first creek. So. Yeah, there's a possibility we might have just fucking not found it, but, um, yeah, Blake... You did wonders mate, thanks, credit to you mate. You did well. I take back everything I've said about you. <laughs> Good boy. Shake. Sit. Good boy. Shake. Shake Blake. Shake. Shake. Shake my hand. Yeah. Good boy. Good five. Good stuff. washing there. Are you alright with that mate? I'll get some footage of you going up the hill. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's the most spectacular recovery. <laughs> yeah, every now and again you do get them in a country spot, but hey, we're pretty, like I say, we're pretty privileged here. It's, um, 
still not that bad really considering um, some of the places I've had to get deer out of in the, yeah. in the past, especially up in the Ruanis. I've carried them for bloody three hours between three of us, you know. Yeah. I'm stuck right in the wheel well. <laughs> <laughs> right in the foot well. So you got two nice big hinds and um, two nice yearlings. Yeah. Beautiful. Job's just about done. Oh, well, Jace, it looks like you've done all right there, mate, in the end. Yeah, got there in the end. Uh, had to work for it, but, um, you know, it was good, man. Good. Managed to redeem yourself, mate, on uh, that shot last oh, night. Had a, had a bit of a miss last night on probably the easiest one out of the lot, to be honest, and um, made up for it this morning, so, yeah, uh, very happy. We can blame that on the mechanical um, problem there as well. It wasn't human error. It was uh, the rifle was shooting, like we said before, about four inches high. So yeah, it was shooting high. So we um, got back to the hut last night and re-zeroed it, and yeah, definitely paid off. So yeah, pulled off that nice neck shot at 309 meters. Yeah, it was so fucking awesome. So I think we'll make that bit of uh, a bit of a wrap for this one, guys. So once again, thanks for watching, and um, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. If you like my content and. Uh, if you want to book a hunt, get in touch with us. You can either give me a call on 027 546 2121 or get in touch with us on our webpage, which is www.ohenirata.hunting.co.nz. Worth the trip. Cheers. Cheers. Sweet.